Good morning, Facebook. Happy Friday or Thursday, wherever you are in the world. I have a super quick live stream for you guys this morning. I am not going to be long at all because I have a morning full of clients. But I wanted to jump on and I wanted to share this message with you all because I'm, th I'm feeling like a few of you this morning probably need to hear this. Probably need to hear this. So if you are here joining me live, let me know that you're here. Say hi. Send me those love bombs and likes. You guys know the drill when you're on my live streams. You need to let me know that you're here. You need to say hi. Otherwise, I just feel you creeping out. All right. Hey, Nora, Scott, Mia. Awesome. Okay. This is what I wanted to quickly share with you guys this morning. I am so pumped at the moment. I don't know if you can feel the energy, but I am so pumped right now because the last two weeks, actually not even really two weeks, probably a week and a bit, I have spent, hey Scott, I have been spending some time talking with new clients who are starting with me in January. And I am so pumped, but I want to share with you a trend that's been happening with all of them, right? We get on calls on like 20 minute calls. Wow, that was really loud. We get on like, he probably needs to get his car checked. Um, we get on, hey Brandon, how are you going? We get on like 20 minute calls and as you guys know, I get to the blocks very quickly and this is exactly what I've been doing. Every single call that I've had, it's like boom, 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 boom. What's going on? Why are you doing it? Why are you feeling that way? This is the issue. This is what we need to work on. And for them, for the clients, it's like, it, it feels like a bit of a fry pan slap to the face. And I get it because initially it can feel yuck, right? It can feel yuck at first realizing what's holding you back. And when they become aware of it, I can feel it because I've been through it myself and I'm very big on energy. So I can feel the energy as well. I can feel that they get a sense of like angst and uncomfortable feeling and even though they're excited because they feel this sense of empowerment that they know they now know where they're holding themselves back and what they need to do even though they feel like that they also have this sense of like angst come over them and this this feeling of holy crap like this is really happening like this is why I have been this way my whole life and it's daunting. And, and I always allow them, to, I hold that space for them. I hold that space and I let them feel that uncomfortable feeling because I get it and I understand it and I respect it. And I think it's important to feel that initially. You know, the first session is always the hardest because I make you aware of everything that you're doing that's self-sabotaging and that can feel like a fry pan slap to the face. It can sting a little bit and it can feel uncomfortable. So I want you guys to understand because this is always the response that I get from people. They're like, I feel excited, but at the same time, I'm so scared. I feel ready, but I'm scared. I feel anxious and I get it. And I want you guys to get this, even though you might may have heard it before. I want you guys to understand this. Growth is not meant to feel comfortable. It's not meant to feel easy. It's not. Because if it did feel easy, if it did feel comfortable, everyone would be doing what is necessary to get them from where they are now to where they want to be. This is why everyone and a lot of people feel stuck and unfulfilled and unhappy and unmotivated. Because if it was easy, everyone would be doing what's necessary. So I wanted to jump on here and just remind you guys that if you personally, whether it's with, with me or whether it's with somebody else or whether you're just starting out your journey of growth, I want you to get this and understand this. Do not let the feeling of un feeling uncomfortable stop you from doing what's necessary. I don't want you to allow that feeling of discomfort to throw you off your path of growth and to throw you off your journey. And I want you to know that if you are feeling uncomfortable, that's what you're actually meant to feel because you're stepping into a version of you that you haven't had before, you haven't been before. It's still you, it's just that next level version of you that is going after what you truly, truly want. And a lot of people feel the uncomfortable feeling and they get put off by that or they feel disheartened by that. 
if it feels easy, you're probably not growing. You're probably not shifting and transforming the way you need to in order to shift your entire life if it feels easy. So if you're on a journey right now and you're feeling uncomfortable and you feel scared, I'm urging you to sit with that, sit with it, allow yourself to go through the motions and know that you don't have to feel alone doing this. This is one thing I make very clear to my clients. I say, I get you feeling uncomfortable. I know you feel really uncomfortable right now. I know you feel slightly scared right now, but I want you to understand I am on this journey with you 150%. I am here to support you 150%. You are not alone. This is my job. This is what I love doing. This is what I'm here for. So do not feel that you ever have to be on this journey alone and don't feel that you, you can't be supported along the way because there are plenty of people out there that can and are willing to support you but you have to allow yourself to feel uncomfortable first. You have to. And a lot of people say, yeah, but it's not easy. It's not easy to change. It's not easy to grow. No, it's not. It is absolutely not because it requires you to go internally and undo a whole lot of learning and beliefs and wire, internal wiring that you have been working diligently at for years your entire life, it requires you to go in and to change all of that and to shift all of that. And that's not easy. And I get it. It's not meant to be easy. As I said, if it was easy, everyone would be doing it. If it felt comfortable, everyone would be doing it. But it's not comfortable. It's not easy. But the important thing is to acknowledge the fact that you feel uncomfortable, but to not let that throw you off your path because it doesn't need to. If you're feeling uncomfortable, find the right people to support you and let them hold your hand through that discomfort because I can promise you, you will get to a point where you can hold your own. We always need people to support us. We should always have someone in our life who is mentoring us, you know, showing us the way. Find someone who is where you wanna be and let them support you. Brendan says, yep, I've felt the turbulence this week. Yeah, and I, Brendan, I know you get it because you're a coach as well. I know you get this. Guys, please get out of your head that growth and change is meant to feel easy and it's meant to feel comfortable because it is far from that. It isn't meant to feel that way because if it was, no one would be walking around upset or depressed or unfulfilled or unmotivated or listening to crappy beliefs that they've been listening to for years because we would be able to navigate through that. Your job is to make that decision that you no longer want to be where you are right now and then find the right people or person to support you through that journey. I have brought on probably about eight or nine new clients over the past week and a half that are starting with me in January and every single one of them has said to me, Alisa, I'm ready. I am so ready, but I am so scared. And I have, to, I have to reassure all of them and let them know that's okay. That scared feeling doesn't mean or shouldn't mean that you have to now second guess yourself or allow yourself to stay where you are. If you're feeling that uncomfortable feeling, you're on the right path. You're making the right decision because change is on the other side of this. So I'm going to leave it there. I really just wanted to jump on and remind you guys of this because I think it's so important, so important that you guys don't have this, this illusion that growth and change should feel easy or it should feel comfortable or there shouldn't be any fear around that because that is so far from the truth. It's not funny. All right, so let that sit with you. And if you're on a journey right now, if all you take from this is that you let yourself sit with the uncomfortable feeling of growth and you don't give up and you don't quit and you give yourself permission to keep moving forward one step at a time, I promise you, I promise you, you will end up where you want to be. 
The only way you won't end up where you want to be is if you stop altogether. All right? I'm going to leave it there. Have an awesome day or night wherever you are. Share or tag someone in this live stream if you think they need to hear it. And I will chat to you guys soon. And if you want to start with me in January, now is your last chance to send me a message and get on board because I have very, very minimal spaces left. All right? Chat to you guys soon. Sending love. Bye.